No, that was the fakest oh okay I've ever heard in my life. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Beth, you're the boogeyman, I can tell. <laughs> Welcome back to Super Life. This is session three. Yes, here we are at session three. And I know because statistics that many of you aren't subscribed to my channel. And if that's you and you're just sitting there watching my content without being subscribed, just, you know, keep on doing it and consider subscribing. In order to explain to y'all what happened this week, I'm going to have to go back and revisit a little bit of what happened last week. Look at her. Here's Queen digging in what I can only assume is her dungeon or hole or something. Yes, this is from last week when we were boogeyman. Let's come up and see. Oh, she's got vis uh, villagers up here. That's good. That's, that's nice. Who's coming? Oh, why, it's myself. And what do I get but a message from a villager? And it says, help us. So I do. And how I do that is I hop in and I flood Queen's suspicious quarters here with mob eggs. But I have to say, what happened to that hole that we just came up and threw? What did she do? Anyway, let's take a look at how she's handling this situation, how she's gaming this. And she's actually doing quite well. I gotta say, if it hadn't been for me... Zulon, you were borderline, but Lizzie was the one who tried to kill me. I kind of committed it to helping her, and then I found out she was the boogeyman. I have to excuse me, pardon me, I have no idea how that audio got in there or those titles. It was a total glitch. Anyway, take a look at the, the results. Day I get the boogeyman, Zulon <laughs> you are on the top of my list. I will pursue you to the ends of this map, See? and you look, will look, look. I don't care. See, she already is. She, she's kill. already we'll threatening. Or we'll both be killed. Well, that was enough to scare me and Beth up out of that cave we were in to another place up a little north of that on the cove. And then Ori's to the west of us. She's a friend. Another friend, Crid, to the south of us. And we're really close to Spawn as well. Kay and Lily are to the north of Spawn. And to the north of them are Zoo and Kitty. So, uh oh, breaking news. Breaking news. And this is live and we've been expecting this. It's what I thought too. Queen of Drama is, she is about to make uh, some sort of a statement. We have an inside source, but since that threat that she made on my life, um, I have been expecting something like this. Let's listen. We should create a Northern Alliance. There is a lot oh. of us. We are, we are all green. Uh -huh. Dark mm -hmm. and light this, green. This could work. And yeah. Mm -hmm. This mm -hmm. is a large force we reckon with. So we've had a little conquer. bit of a chat about the fact that we have all decided to reside in the north side of the map. I made the observation mm -hmm. that we are all green names, and it could be a very powerful alliance to have all of us a large group as a, as the as the strong north alliance. Um, and can I just add to it that um, Luffy is our enemy? Could we also <laughs> yes. please add Lizzie? Ooh. Yep. How do we feel about Havoc? While we're dropping names. I have a secret. Are we ready for the secret? Wait, no, no, stop, 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 stop. Who is this guy with the, with the power to shut down a queen? Is he a fun-loving, bespectacled, headset-wearing guy, or is he something more? You may be shocked at what we found. You didn't hear it from me, okay? No. No. I, just keep killing. Just a strong wind. Just keep killing the pig. You think this will divide me and Queen, though? Lies. I won't allow it. Which kind of begs the question, what else does Cozy Crafted not allow? And this kid he's talking to is Chunk Purse, this sweet kid who lives on the back of a mountain on our server in a junkyard. Just a sweet, simple kid with sweet, simple desires, like maybe some bees for his bus, or maybe like a yard toilet. Let's listen to him during a recent interaction we caught with friend Havoc. I'll deliver your horse right back at you. Thank you for your tree letter. Of course, sorry it took so long. It's shipping and handling, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So deliver my horse to me. It's alive, right? It's completely alive. Oh. Well, where is it? And just listen to what happens the minute Cozine thinks that Chunk is going to leave him. You want to follow me? <coughs> no! No! Yeah, I don't like the sound of no, that, Chunk! No. <laughs> Cozy and Queen together, by the way, can be referred to as Cozine, and we weren't the only one with questions. Why, why, why don't you want, maybe you don't want Chunk to go. Why don't you want Chunk to go? Because hmm? hmm? we were just working on something, just, is all. Yeah, you know. That's strange. Hmm. Not that's letting strange. a person go, that's, that's taking somebody hostage, you know? I mean, Chunk, <laughs> Chunk is free to go. 
Well, we certainly hope so, Cozy. We certainly hope so. And now we turn our attention to an illicit underground dance club discovered on Villager Island. Tr trading hall? Show us. Show us your... Ow! Ow! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, indeed, Chunk. Oh my gosh, indeed. I guess that is what happens when you expose yourself to the seedy and cruel underbelly. All right, and for reference, the location of Villager Island is right here. And for its proximity to Spawn, it's here. Uh, above Spawn to the North, Kay and Lily, Zoo and Kitty, and this lousy, stinky Northern Alliance. Queen and Cozy, and unfortunately, poor Chunk is roped in with them. They are allied with Kay and Lily and Zoo and Kitty, but not like Queen and Cozy together. Cozy, and they are as thick as thieves. Chunk and Cozy also thick, but they don't... I hopefully not unbreakable my response to the news that there were literal forces aligning against me was to build this small cottage course style house it was nice to get some building done and it gave me time to think I came up with this action plan and this awesome schedule and there were check marks and X's and O's and bar graphs that lines that went up all those things equating to of course obviously what they always do stonks stonks in the form of a great idea nice. Mm. How nice. Very nice. Flappy, do you want to be in an alliance with us there's a northern alliance there is a northern alliance. alliance I think we yeah, should have we the should. kind of like uh, what? Western. The Western Alliance, yeah. Cause the same I'm getting down on one knee. Hi. Hi. <laughs> I humbly ask, would you like to join the Western Alliance? Absolutely. Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely. Yes, yes. Absolutely. Western Alliance. Wait, Western Alliance? Western Alliance. Uh, okay, yeah, I would, I would do that. Okay. I, okay. I, I, I don't have any affiliation <laughs> at the moment, so I'm free. Okay, well, now you do. Now you do. Mm, there is a very strong force gathering in the north. Okay, who's in it? It's me and you, and Kat, and Beth, and Lappy, mm -hmm. and then, then Crid doesn't like alliances. Crid is our friendly neighbor. Take that mm. to mean whatever it means. Mm. Crid lives in the West. That's his house right there. Yeah, yeah, I know. Right there. I know. Yeah. So friendly neighbor, he says. Friendly neighbor. Friendly neighbor. I trust that. I do. I do. And and we're above him. Uh, so. <laughs> okay, uh, Richie. I, I don't know. Nice. Geographically, like I feel <laughs> yeah. like um, that oh. somehow will give us an advantage. I don't know over what or why, but I hope I so. I feel advantage being up. Yeah, yeah. So. so yeah, do you, is there? Do you guys want to build outpost bases here, or do you already have big bases somewhere? I, else? I don't have a big base. Uh, I have just an underground hole with with one cow spawner, and that's oh, it. Oh <laughs> no! Yeah, yeah. Come over here. The third part of my action plan is a big one. It's an important one. It is a name change. I do not wish for us to any longer be called the Western Alliance. I wish to be called Avengers. And that's it. That's going to do it for this week's episode of Super Life. Sorry for the kind of unorthodox approach, um, but I hope you liked it. Um, I enjoyed making it. I lost some footage, so it was kind of a, a thing I had to do, but I enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for coming to my video and join us next week. Or should I probably say join us in a couple days when we record session four live on Twitch. Uh, 5 a.m. Central Standard Time, 6 Eastern, all kinds of other times across the world. And be sure to check out all the other awesome creators. I have them linked in the description down below. Thanks again, guys. Bye-bye.